This one from Tony Edward Thinking Crypto. Little thread here on what's taking place. He says, I spoke to a source who cannot be named and they gave me insight on the at attack on crypto, aka Operation Choke Point 2.0. This person worked in government and now in the crypto industry. This attack was green lighted from the top. It is coming from the Biden administration. This is why you see the SEC, CFTC, and other agencies targeting crypto companies in parallel. This is why Gary Gensler is so bold and not afraid of the consequences. He knows he doesn't have a case, but he's still moving forward anyways. The negative influence on the administration is coming from the following parties. Janet Yellen absolutely does not like crypto. SEC Chair Gensler wants more power for the SEC and will give some of it back when regulations come, but will have a large slice of the pie by then. As we always said, about 90% of these coins did an ICO, they do classify as a security. So Gary Gensler's SEC is going to have jurisdiction over a lot of crypto. We've always said that. The Fed, stable coins undermine the Fed and banking industry's control of money to a certain degree. I've personally spoken about this. CBDCs are coming. The digital dollar cannot be usurped by stable coins. Gary Gensler wants to be, face, to be the face of this attack because he wants to build this clout and resume. He would like to get the treasury job in the future. Okay, so, so Gary's looking to get stepped on up here to treasury, I guess. Can this be stopped? Yes, but Congress has to act. Will they? That's the big question. I hope Tom Emmer, Bill Huizenga, Tim Scott, Patrick McHenry, and others can get something done this year. Prepare for more pain. The attack has just started. They will continue to apply pressure. Of course, fraudster SBF, Sam Bankman Freed, gave them the ammo they needed to be this aggressive. We have to fight back. We have to drum up as much noise as we did with the infrastructure bill. My opinion, we are in the, quote, then they fight you phase, as we've seen throughout history then they can slow disruptive tech but they can't stop it i'm bullish long term me as well real utility real projects but you have to watch out because we've got a crypto war underway i am your host zach rector i really appreciate all of the love and support if you want to support the channel just remember that you can start by smashing that thumbs up for me sharing this content far and wide and everything else is at my website